Hey guys, what's up? It's Simply Sasha414 here and it feels so weird to be in front of the camera again but I'm super excited and I really really missed it like you guys don't know how much I missed it. One, I want to apologize if the lighting's a little weird. Um, I'm waiting on my cousin to bring me another light bulb. That's a long story but uh, but I didn't want to wait because it was getting it's getting not dark but it's later on in the day and I really wanted to film this video so I might film some more though when she comes but yeah I feel like I might look a little shiny but let's just ignore that because I'm back making videos anyways um I just want to kind of explain kind of not give an excuse but it might sound like an excuse um I won I kind of just got uh I don't want to say discouraged but I kind of lost like what I want to do with my channel um I kind of want to do still beauty videos but I still I want to do like beauty st slash lifestyle videos and I want to do vlogging uh, maybe not every day but like when I'm doing something special or I know if I'm doing something big or I just feel like turning on and talking to the camera um that's what I really want to do so I'm trying to kind of push this channel in a different direction which I think a lot of people on YouTube have been doing anyway kind of just redirecting their channel and things like that also I am 23 I'm going through changes life changes personal changes you know I'm in school it's just it was just a lot happening from December to now um, it's the first and I really want to get up a video I'm gonna try for two videos a week if not there will definitely be one video a week um, whether it's just me talking I just want to get into back into the groove of filming and uploading on a schedule um yeah i'm in school now but i have spring break this week i don't know if i'm gonna be doing anything but i do have my best friend from georgia coming down in a couple weeks and that's exciting and yeah i'm just really really excited and really ready to get back into filming also if you guys have any you know video ideas and things like that you know let me know in the comments down below what kind of videos you guys would like me to see and what kind of ideas you think you guys have um, I would really appreciate it I'm just gonna go ahead and move on and go into my favorites I had I have been having a few favorites of February and yeah I want to go ahead and show you guys so this was just like a short hey where I've been video so sorry if this video is long also because I haven't filmed in a long time I might be a little talkative and let's get started Okay, so the first thing I guess I'm gonna go with is a little bit of skincare. I only have two things. I bought these wipes because I ran out of wipes, and these are the Pacifica wipes, Purify wipes. Um, they smell really, really good. They're coconut water cleansing wipes, and they smell really good, like I said, and they feel really good on my skin. They just smell really, really clean and fresh, and I really, really like them. It's for all skin types. Um. It didn't really dry out my skin. My skin's already kind of dry, but it didn't really dry it out any worse. And it got off all my makeup, and it really got off the eyeliner, which I'll show you soon. The eyeliner that I use, it's a little stubborn. It's not Urban Decay, but it's still pretty good. The next thing I want to show you guys is my moisturizer. And this is the Olay Do Over Hydrating Gel Moisturizer. And this is how it looks. And I really, really like it. It smells really good. It's very hydrating. I really like gel um, moisturizers because it's it's mostly oil-free. This doesn't say oil-free, but gel are good for, like, combination oily skin. And I really, really like it. So it's really moisturizing. It's kind of like this blue aqua color. So, yeah. The next thing I'm going to go into, I guess, is face products. And I want to show you guys. Um beauty blender i finally got it and the first time i used this was really funny i didn't like it because i i, I was using it wrong but um it's really really good as you can tell it's bigger right now because i kind of just used it but i really like it when i first used it i put too much i didn't like dry it out enough like i had it really really damp and you can't use it that damp it has to be 
wet to almost dry kind of consist like feeling but I really love it it makes my makeup seem like flawless um I think but anyways the next thing I want to show you guys is like foundation I've been either using concealer and this is my matte this is my MAC Pro Longwear Concealer in the color NW45 and as you can see it is like done. I need to get a new one and I kind of finished my foundation from there which I also love. But I've been also using the CoverGirl Outlast Stay Fabulous um, Foundation and this is my second bottle. And this is in the color Soft Sable so if any of you guys are like wondering. Um, number 875 and you guys have seen this. I really like it because it's a 3 in 1 foundation and it really primes and it conceals and you know if I'm not wearing my concealer and powder I'm wearing this by itself with some powder because I get a little oily and speaking of powder I have the studio Mac fix powder in MW50 and it just looks like this and sorry for blinding you guys but um yeah I really really love this this is a holy grail this is like basically the only powder I really lose use sometimes I use a translucent powder which I have like samples of but always love this because especially if I get like a foundation that's too light for me this is my you know direct this is my exact shade so I can put it over and it'll like oxidize and then match you know throughout the day so I really really like it the next thing I'm gonna show you guys is an eyeshadow palette and then the rest stuff is like lip and some eye stuff but um I got this eye palette like a couple weeks ago off of QVC and it came like as a package it came with like the eyeshadow um, palette the um what was it uh mascara and like a lip product but yeah so I got the Too Faced chocolate bar palette and I love this thing this thing is so pretty and so nice the shades are super pretty here are the shades right here they are so pretty I'm sure you guys seen this before it really makes me want to get the second one I think it's like the semi sweet I really really want it I think I have that at my job I work at Macy's um, so I think I'm gonna get that one next and probably do a video side by side which I probably have seen before but I want to do a video and sorry if I'm talking really fast it's because the Sun's going down and I'm trying to get you know the lighting but um yeah I'll have everything linked down below for sure and yeah this one where is it? This um, brown color right here is so pretty. J just ugh, this color. All of them are just gorgeous. I just love it all. So yeah, I love that. And then for my two eye products, I'll show you really quick. One is the MAC um, Graphic Black Tech Coal Liner. And it's just a black liner, but I really like it because it's a retractable liner. It's really soft. It doesn't tug on my eyes. It doesn't make my eyes watery. Some eyeliners I've been using lately have been irritating my eyes and making them really watery. But this one is amazing. Love MAC stuff, obviously. And then a mascara is the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. This mascara, guys, just like, let's just take a moment for this mascara it is amazing the hype about it is real like so I'm stubborn so it takes me a minute to try like stuff that's really really big or talked about but this stuff is amazing I'm wearing it today and I don't even have it like hyped up on my lashes like usually I put like three coats and this thing is like ridiculous like my cousin even noticed and I don't have great eyelashes so my cousin was like yeah what is what mascara are you using? Are you wearing falsies? I was like, no, girl, no. It's all about the better than sex. Like, get you some, guys. Like, try the sample version. The the mini one is. <sighs> I need to do a video on this because this stuff. Mm, holy grail! I'd make a holy grail video. Holy grail item. Get you some. Leg like eleven's gorgeous. Let's say. But anyways, all right. So the next things are lippies because my everyday lippies my everyday um look consists of winged semi-winged liner lots of lashes and a different lip um either it's just lashes and a lip or a liner and a lip whichever i feel like doing so no complete order this is what i'm wearing right now i'm not wearing a lip product i'm wearing the Maline mojito lip balm and I got this in an Ipsy bag. Uh, it just looks like this. It's really moisturizing. I really like it. And it brings some shine to my lips. So yeah, I really like that. Another thing I've been loving is these CoverGirl lip products. And this is the newer that came out recently or this year. 
and I have two colors one in 375 and 305 so one's like a purpley mauve color which looks like this which is really gorgeous and the next one is a red because I just love buying different red products it looks kind of purple but it's really a true red and oh, like a fire engine red so pretty so there's that the next one I'll do my MAC products because there are two of them um, one is a cream sheen in cream cream in your coffee so it's like just a nude color and I've been wanting a nude color for the longest I'll swatch this one because it's really pretty it just looks like that very pinky nude I wanted a pinky nude because I like pink on my lips I like an everyday color and then this one is diva which a lot of you have probably heard of I don't know but diva is really like this nice berry dark color and I really like it. it's kind of like an everyday color too for me the next one is this and it's like a uh, lip stain and it's from L'Oreal and these came out like last year but um I really like this sometimes I put this on by itself or sometimes I put it on and then layer it over something but it's really really pretty really love it my next one is another one that I use like all the time I think it's like almost done it's, this is in Smitten and this is by I forgot who is this by it's like all off I forgot what this is I think it's a Revlon yeah it's by Revlon and this is pretty as you can tell I've been kind of in the berries kind of berry kind of shades really love it I mean it's still winter it's almost spring I might lighten it up a little and um this lip gloss by uh NYX and I use this if I want to lighten up you know the berry color and it's like a really pale pink so it really does a nice job of lightening up the berry colors and giving it like this pretty finish that I really enjoy and then last but not least is this beautiful packaged Too Faced lip stick that I got with um, the mascara and the palette and it's just a nice very nude color and also I would put this on first and then maybe put a um because it's very loud very pigmented actually I only did like a little but it's very loud so I usually mix not loud but it's very like pale so I usually mix it with a pink and it's just ugh, gorgeous when I mix it with a berry so these are my lips that I've been wearing and yeah that is pretty much my favorite I did have a candle it's over there though but it's a bath and body works called fresh linen candle it smells like you just did fresh laundry or just cleaned your like with like kind of like a lemon kind of smell smells really good but yeah that is my video guys my hair Ugh. that is my video that is, those are my favorites let me know what your favorites are in the down board down below because I really want to know what you've been loving for the month of February let's say March for the month of February and also comment down below what videos you guys would like to see from me um thumbs up this video i've missed you guys if you missed me i hope you did um i missed you guys a lot but um yeah thank you guys so so much for watching and i look forward to seeing you guys soon bye this is